Lance Dover will be in to attempt a field goal. Looks like it's going to be about a 47-yard field goal attempt. Stover has hit field goals tonight of 44, 34, 27. And now will attempt a 47-yard field goal. Almost straight away with Boozer to hold. Snap is down. Here's the kick. He's got the distance. He's got the height. And he has got the accuracy. A 47-yard field goal by Matt Stover. And there's timeout on the field with 9 minutes, 13 seconds left to go in the football game. Louisiana Tech 33, USL 14. Third down and 10, USL on their own three. And Miller back in the end zone to throw and throws it and it is intercepted. Interception made by Freddie Smith and Smith's going to take it for a touchdown. Freddie Smith, a junior from Malvern, Arkansas, 25 yards on the interception return for a touchdown. Second down, nine yards to go, Tech, at the Western Michigan 32-yard line. Gene Johnson, sophomore out of West Monroe, back to throw. Look, steps in the pocket, wants to go for it all, toward the end zone, caught, touchdown! Oh, what a catch! you got to love it, Bobby Slaughter. Oh, my goodness. 32 yards, Scott Bell, Brian Johnson, double team, and Johnson and Slaughter just made a fabulous catch in the end zone, and he is still down. Snap clock is not working again, but they have not noticed it. It's third and goal at the one. Johnson takes a touchdown. Gene Johnson for the touchdown off the right side. That's what you call a quick snap. When he came up to the line of scrimmage, most of the time you'll see the linemen get down. What they do on that situation, the first thing they hear out of the quarterback's mouth, they go on. It's one of those audibles, boom, and they're gone. And that's what happened, and Johnson just sneaked it across the right side into the end zone, and the dogs get a touchdown on a quarterback sneak by Gene Johnson. And now Matt Stover will be in to attempt the point after with Boozer to hold. Instead of getting three, we get six and trying to make it seven on the board. Here's the snap. The ball is down. Stover's kick is up, and it's perfect. Timeout on the field. 10.36 left to go. First half. It's Florida 10, Louisiana Tech 7 linebackers four yards on the pickup tech looking at third down and let's call it about three and a half to go for a first down you have to get just inside the four for a first down tech is just outside their own at the east carolina seven yard line near hash mark Derek fitzhenry goes in motion here goes the pitch to douglas douglas at the five douglas at the four douglas touchdown you gotta love it Derek Douglas, second, third, and maybe even a fourth effort went seven yards and zero. He must have been hit three or four times. Derek Fields, he just carried him into the end zone. Here's the pump. Here's the throw for Bobby Slaughter toward the end zone. Touchdown! Bobby Slaughter with a little look and go and a touchdown, and the dogs have taken the lead. He just beat Ricky Torrain. 30 yards on a touchdown pass. Gene Johnson pumped once, and then that throws the quarterback, and Slaughter took off, and the pass, a beautiful catch, a beautiful throw, and the dogs have taken the lead. Second down and goal at the five. Johnson puts, puts Henry in motion. The pitch goes to Douglas. Douglas looking for a block. He is in the end zone for a touchdown. He got the block from Fitz Henry, who came back, peeled back, got the block, and Derek Douglas slides diving into the end zone for the touchdown, and the Bulldogs have taken a 25 to 14 lead, and Greenville, North Carolina, Bigland Stadium, has all of a sudden got even quieter.
down and goal tech at the three yard line of Northern Illinois from the near hash mark Derek Douglas gets the pitch cuts it back touchdown Derek Douglas and the dogs have taken the early lead at six to nothing two yards on a touchdown run by the senior running back Derek Douglas out of three four captain three one yard line on fourth down and goal after one the same offensive set it's Henry goes in motion here is Johnson rolling throws toward the end zone touchdown Paul Kennedy the tight end Paul Kennedy the senior from Sunnyvale Texas on the touchdown reception by Gene Johnson First down and 10, Tech at the 37-yard line of Northern Illinois. Johnson to throw. Four-man rush, has some time, setting up the screen. They complete it to Douglas. Douglas gets around one man, 35, 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown! You gotta love it. Oh, you gotta love it. He faked one way on Patrick Bryan, and Douglas went the other way, and then it was clean sailing into the end zone, and the Dogs have taken a 20-7 to lead. First down and goal, Tech at the six-yard line of Northern Illinois. And here is Johnson rolling left, looking. He's being chased, looking toward the end zone. He's going to run the football, now throws. Pop! Touchdown! Corey Parham, the freshman from Dallas, made the catch. And Gene Johnson was awfully close to the line of scrimmage, coming to his left. Threw back with the right hand, and Corey Parham, the freshman from Dallas, Texas, has just made his first reception. Down and 10, Louisiana Tech. Dogs have it on the Northern Illinois 37 and a half yard line. Derek Douglas, the lone running back, four man defensive front, and Johnson to throw. Steps up in the pocket. He wants to go for all of it to Slaughter. Touchdown! Bobby Slaughter, you gotta love it. The fourth touchdown pass of the afternoon for Gene Johnson. And Bobby Slaughter, the junior out of Rushton, he just beat the defensive back by a mile. By a mile. Red Tucker wasn't even close, he wrote. Bobby Slaughter is bent to the right. To the left side is Eddie Brown. Gene Johnson, the quarterback. Huskies in a four-man defensive front. Rushes on. Wanting to throw long toward the end zone. Slaughter! Touchdown! Five touchdown passes for Gene Johnson, and that is a new Louisiana Tech record. A new record for Gene Johnson. Five touchdown passes this afternoon, his second to Bobby Slaughter, a great throw and another great catch, and the dogs have exploded to a 41-7 lead on a 38-yard touchdown pass. That's along with Zero Brown, we're at Jonesburg, Arkansas, Tech trailing. 14 to nothing, looking at third down and 14. Arkansas State coming with the blitz. Johnson is rolling, throwing toward the end zone. Touchdown, Slaughter. Well, the Bulldogs read the blitz perfectly. Johnson rolled out from the pressure to the left side and threw on the run to a streaking Bobby Slaughter in the end zone, who had beaten the defender by about six or seven yards, 27 yards on the touchdown pass. Gene Johnson to Bobby Slaughter. Down and goal for Tech. Derek Douglas again. Douglas touchdown. Derek Douglas got in off the right side this time as the lead block by Michael Richardson. And Douglas gets into the end zone and the Bulldogs have put six more on the board. And it's 37 to 31. This one ain't over yet. So the Bulldogs have it first down at the Arkansas State 11-yard line with 2.35 left to go in the game. Tech trailing 37-32. Gene Johnson engineering the Bulldog offense. Takes the snap. Gives it to Richardson. Richardson at the 10. At the 5. At the touchdown. you got to love it. The 11 yards on the touchdown run by Michael Richardson. His third touchdown of the year on the Bulldogs have taken the lead for the first time tonight at 38 to 37 would you believe it would you ever believe it